hey, hey. Also known as Makana, hey, hey. He's our travel partner for the weekend. He doesn't shriek like the chicken in Target. It'd be really funny if you ran into Alan Tudyk right now and he just shrieked at us. It'd be great. No, because Alan Tudyk's not here and Duh. Okay. What up? This is Hi Hi! Hi Hi Vision! Woo! Chicken! <laughs> all right. Instead of saying all right, I'll right away, he goes hey, 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 I haven't filmed an intro yet, so this is what I'm doing. We're at Boston Comic Con. She's filming an intro. Intro. Um, and we just picked up our passage for tomorrow. Intro it is Thursday. To intro to basic science? Intro to my vlog. And now we're gonna go get burritos and then check into the hotel. It's in there. It's in Quincy Market. That would be me. I was former military. They're like, what? Yeah, they didn't like fish nuts in the <laughs> We're on a hunt for mac and cheese. <laughs> shake, shake. Hell's rattling. Oh, it's dark. It's dark. And then we also have Chinese food because fucking pigs. <laughs> Look at that. Burgers. It's dark. But this is the hotel room that we're staying at tonight. This hey hey. Because we have to get a friend at the airport early, or rather she's getting him early, so we're staying here tonight. It's the hotel. It's really tiny. It's Eric. Burgers. So we are in the hotel room and we're getting settling, settled for the night. And I think I showed you guys. It has bunk beds. And that's Eric. But it has bunk beds. This really cool TV. It's really small, but we're just staying here for tonight anyways because we're picking up a friend at the airport and the bathroom is in that area. Um, but it, it's really nice for just like the one night, but yes, um, we're selling in. We just had some Shake Shack and I think I'm going to call it a night. I think I'm going to put this in day one together of Comic-Con. So yeah, say good night. Good night. Oh, I'm vlogging in the bathroom because it's better light and eating a Pop-Tart. Good morning, everybody. I'm currently half in costume with my jacket. Eric's just about secret Rick Grimesing. Uh, yeah, we're just about ready to get to the convention. It's gonna be fun. Like I say, we're just about ready to go check into the second hotel a little bit. Then we have time to kill the convention is early previews at two and we get VIP so we get to go in early. So yeah. Slagging. Ah! Hotel room number two. Say hi. Hi. Hey, partner. <laughs> Wonder what our view is, probably just like a rooftop. What you doing with my jerky? Ooh. Rooftop. There's so much egg. <laughs> and they're making fun of <laughs> We're just like <laughs> We're just silently judging everybody. Silently judging every single person. <laughs> I really hope I find like a Betty and Veronica. Just walk. Yeah, just keep going straight. Keep going straight. <laughs> what are we doing, Eric? Huh? What are we doing? What did we just do? We just uh, Oh, we just see this and you. And what else? We went to the ATM. <laughs> so we're going to meet Barrowman? Yeah, we're going to meet Barrowman. Ha ha ha!
happy you're running this booth right now? What? Are you happy that you're running this booth right now? This is Joe's booth. He does all this stuff. They ran to go do a thing. And we're watching Super and Bore Anderson. She's eating. <laughs> Real food at that. Fish and chips. Not bad con food. Waiting for this. Waiting for this. I'm gonna freak out. Waiting for this. Serenity, and I was like, and I think she's a beautiful girl. And I was like looking over, and then like sign, looking over and stuff. And finally, like we were done, we were done signing, and like he went back, whatever. And I like peeked through the curtain and shit, and peeked through the curtain again. And I'm like, do I go over and maybe see if they'll sign something or say hi? And all of a sudden, I'm like, I peek through one more time. Like I'm gonna go over. I'm gonna go say something. I'm gonna say hi. And I look through the curtain, and she goes, What the fuck are you looking at? <laughs> Okay, so I'm editing this vlog right now, and I realized that I didn't explain my experience meeting Jason Mewes and Kevin Smith um, in the actual vlog. Um, we had met Jay, if you guys can see me telling Eric earlier, um, at his table. We, we didn't know he was going to have a table, because um, it wasn't listed on the website. And um, I had wanted to tell Kevin this story, that how I got into his movies. So Kevin wasn't signing, but I decided to go to Jay's table and explain to Jay um, the story. So it's, it's a really long story and I'm not going to get into it here, but the short version of it is probably one of the worst weekends of my life was the first weekend that I kind of discovered Kevin Smith movies. And ba basically when I wanted to cry and I had probably the worst mood I could ever be in, um, his movies up until that time, um, made me laugh and it really meant a lot to me and over the years they've kind of helped me get me through it's weird because it's not really those type of movies that should mean that much to someone but because of the situation it did to me um and I told Jay and Jay was awesome and told me that because we had the photo op that I could tell Kevin and I didn't really think I was going to get a chance to because photo ops if you ever go to a convention they are so freaking like rushed um, and I'm gonna insert a clip here of him actually telling me that when I explain it to him and I got a chance to tell Kevin and to the extent where Jay noticed me when we were coming up and told Kevin that I had something to tell him Kevin pulled me into the biggest hug and I got to tell him listen me and him one-on-one -on -one, in that hug exactly what I wanted to say and I cried you can see it in the photo that I'm showing here that I'm basically mid-cry <laughs> and 
it meant so much to me and Jason Muse is just freaking amazing for making sure that happened and it was probably one of like the third best experiences of my life and I am never ever gonna forget that so thank you Jason Muse and that's the story behind me meeting Kevin Smith